And that is the answer to the great potential of every one of us. This is exactly how spiritual you can become. That you can access to an inner, inner gigantic treasure of, of deep understandings and new angles and perspectives on life. If you will give a chance to your spiritual life to take place. If you will allow yourself to go and to set yourself free to an inner world of an inner connection with your true being, with your voice, with your inner voice. Now people are saying, I have so many voices, I have so many thoughts, how will I know which to choose and what to do with all my thoughts, with all my ideas? The answer is simple. There is good and there is bad. There is life and there is death. There are no third opportunities and options. There are only two options in every moment of your life. To attach yourself to the truth or to lie. To be good or to be bad. To be sensitive or to lose your sensitivity. To be honest or not to be honest. To be gentle or not. Every moment of your life is an intersection. You have only two ways to do or not to do, to speak or not to speak, to say that thing that came in my mind or not to say that thing. You need to follow the positive, the good, the kind, the nice, the illuminating voice in your head, the one that is guiding you from within to be honest and to be kind and to be nice and to be positive, to believe, to have faith, to connect yourself to the light, to connect yourself to the Creator, and not to follow the negative voice that tells you that you don't have a chance and that you have to lie and that you must steal and that you're not gonna make it if you won't hide that thing and that you cannot count and that you shouldn't do and that you must be angry now and that you cannot take it anymore. All that negative energy, mark it as an enemy that destroys your life on daily basis and suck your life out from you with all bad attributes that are killing our passion for life and sucks out our joy and our satisfaction from every moment because every moment is an opportunity to rise and to succeed and to shine and to do good and when you're climbing and you're climbing consistently you're climbing high if you fall and fall and fall and fall and fall you're stuck but when you start climbing even a breath of a hair even one inch even one step a tiny development one good thing you're always on that path for success and there is no faster path than to keep on walking, to keep on progressing. There is no faster speed than that, than to know that from your end, from your side, you are making the right effort to succeed. And one day, in one moment, the Creator removes the curtain and open your eyes to see things that are important and needed for your success for your completion, for you to achieve what the, your soul is, is, is meant to, to, to produce and to reveal out to the world. Project all the nations with me, close your eyes, just breathe, see the truth, don't chase the fake world, don't buy the fake news, be yourself, your own true self, don't let no one take our natural wealth, see the good, no fear, no despair, cherish who that you are, and share. Source of power, from an endless spring, light of courage. In yourself, yes. They can kick you down to the ground Hold yourself up till you are put up your crown King of the creator, holy soul inside Focus on the spiritual and you